What's the deal, y'all? We got an away game today, and I'm in a hotel, obviously. So whenever we come to hotels, they make us give our passports to the front desk. And I just want to come out here and tell y'all a little story about something that happened to me back when I played in Tunisia in 2016, 2017. I was actually living in a hotel for the whole season or the whole time I was there because the owner of our team was the owner of the hotel that we were staying in. So obviously it's free. So we stayed there. And they made all the foreign players give our passports to the front desk when we first got there. So they basically had our <laughs> our passports the whole time, the whole season, which I always thought was a little weird, but I was young and not too smart. Didn't know any better, so I gave it to them. And they were being late with payments. So around January, February, I got fed up, man. Booked the booked the flight for the next day. Booked the hotel in Tunis. The team I was playing with was like an hour, oh, like two hours from the capital where the airport was. So booked the hotel, took my bags, went downstairs, told them to give me my passport. I'm leaving because they're not paying me my bread. The girl called the owner. He obviously said, oh, don't give it to him. Wait till he gets there. He want to talk to me. He was hours away. I didn't want to talk to him. Did end up talking. So I went back and forth with this lady for 30 minutes. She dead would not give me my password saying she can't find it. So I said, fuck it. Got in a taxi anyway. Went to Tunis. Got in contact with the American embassy in Tunis. They told me to come to the embassy, uh, talk to the people. They gave me a, a um, temporary, temporary passport, which I could use for a year. Got it the same day. Paid less than $100 for it. And <laughs> I just want to let y'all know that if anything ever happens to your passport while you're overseas, you can always go to the American embassy and they will give you a temporary one. You can use it for a year until you have to get another one that expires after a year from the day that you get it. You can get it the same day and it's not expensive. And do not ever give your passport to a team for a long length of time. Get your passports, keep your passports, man, because these people will do anything. They will hold your passports. They will, like I said, they'll do anything, man, to keep you on the team, especially if you are playing good. So be aware of that, man. Be smart and keep <laughs> keep your passport with you at all times. But obviously some things happen. People misplace their passports. I heard dudes getting their passports stolen overseas because it's an American passport or wherever you're from, like people, especially in some of these Poor countries will try to steal your passport. I don't know why. Maybe they can use it, but they try. So, yeah, man, that's a little <laughs> advice for you all. A little funny story. Crazy stuff, man, happens overseas. So I'm going to come, come over here. I'm going to come on here and share some more stories with y'all. Give y'all some more advice. Yeah, so like this video. Comment on it. If you have any questions, any videos you want me to do, share with any overseas hoopers that need to hear this. If you made it this far in the video, put in the comments, hard work pays off because it does always have, always will. I appreciate y'all, man. And I'm out.